Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Sunday Morning Simulcast with Rom Wills. Success takes effort. Success takes effort. I'm going to tell you what. Going through life, you want to be successful. Hey, let's just be real. Everybody wants to be successful. Yeah, no matter how bad somebody's life might be, they don't want that. Nobody wants that. Yeah, they figure out how to adapt to it and everything, but everybody, everybody wants to be successful. You know, everybody has a dream. Everybody has a dream. Everybody has something that they want to do. But a lot of times they don't. I'll never forget, I was watching a motivational video and it mentioned, and I ain't sure who originally said this. You know how stuff goes around, especially in the motivational circles, uh, about so much talent, so many dreams, ideas, inventions being in the cemetery, people going to their desk with it. But the, here's the thing though, a lot of people don't make the effort. Now some do, in all fairness, some do and they might not make it or they just didn't make the right effort, but at least they did some, many other people don't. It's, it's amazing how often I've met people who say, well, I wanna do this, you know, I wanna be this chef. Or as a writer, I've met plenty of people. They had some good ideas for some novels that might have been bestsellers and stuff. And so, so I'll be like, have you written it? No. I'm going to tell you what. Being successful, I don't care what it is. I don't care what the position is, what the uh, industry is. It takes effort. And see, one, one of the things is success itself is not a straight line. That's one of the things to understand. It's, it's a squiggly ball, you know, to put myself in a position that I'm in. Oh, it, it took a while. Yeah, yeah, I just don't know. Yeah, I just don't know. It, it took a while. I had to do a lot. Anybody who's successful, like maybe on, you know, social media, oh, they had to do a lot. They didn't just start off. They had to do some work. Everybody had to do some work. I don't care what it is. If you get a million dollar doctor, oh, they, you didn't see the hours that they had to put in in medical school, the effort they had to do, you know, the residency, everything. They ain't just start out making all that money. Attorneys, what they had to do. When uh, any business, any business, any, any business, most businesses actually fail. Most businesses actually fail in the first year. In fact, when you talk to successful business people, they usually had started doing something else first, but they put in the effort. Effort just means you just, you just gonna concentrate on doing whatever it is. And whatever it is, you're gonna stick with it. You're gonna stick with it through bad times. You're gonna stick with it through times it look like, oh, you know, this ain't it. You just gonna keep going because one, to be successful, you gotta have it in here. You gotta have it in here. It gotta, it gotta be like no other choice. It gotta be a part of who you are. Now, I've talked before about talents. When you have that talent, that's whatever you have a talent in, you can be successful in, but you still gotta do the work. You ain't gonna just go out there, you know? You ain't gonna just go out there and sing a song or someone start singing. Shoot, you gotta do some work. Let's, let's use singing for an example. Singers got to go through some training, you know, they might have to start off like very small or something. You know, they got to go through some training. They got to work on their vocals. They got to practice, you know, they got to practice. If you talk about a, a comedian, a comedian, all those comedians who probably selling out stadiums and everything. Oh, they probably started out at some comedy club. You know, I'll, I'll give a shout out to uh, Richard Pryor, the late Richard Pryor, may he rest in peace. I remember I saw one of his earliest things. Nobody laughed, it wasn't funny, everything, but he worked at it. All comedians have to work at it. I don't care what the uh, profession is, you gotta work at it. You gotta put in some effort. Now you have some people who wanna dream and say, well, I wanna be this, but then they sitting on their butts. What, what good is that? I want y'all to think about that. What good is that? You're not doing anything. You're not studying. You're not trying to hone your craft. You're not trying to hone your craft. As a writer, you know, my main thing is really writing. And people, you know, I have, you know, an international bestseller. But even before that, the first couple of books I've wrote, please, maybe a few hundred copies each and everything. 
And then even my writing style, I had to keep working at it. I had to put in that effort. And there were setbacks. Shoot, even doing this, there were times when it was going slow. You know? There were times when it was just like, you know, people used to me doing like a video a day and everything. A video a day. There were times, shoot, I was, at first when I started, it was like one video and then another one, now for another year. <laughs> You know, or then once a week, I was making a big deal, but then I had to work at it. And this is while working a full-time job. And see, that's the thing. When, you, when you're on that road to success, well, you know what? You're not going to just jump into whatever you want to do. You might have to work on that nine-to-five job. You might have to put up with some stuff. You might have to live on, uh, sleep on that air mattress. You might have to sleep on that air mattress for a bit. I know I did. I know I did. I had to change it, though, because, you know, air mattresses. Uh, I had to change it, like, every few, every, like, month or so. You know, get that hole in it and everything. But that's part of success. That's part of success. Anybody successful, they can tell you when they had to eat just a little bit. You know, you get some, if you read the biographies or listen to them talk, they'll tell you when it was tough for them. But what the thing they all had in common is, they put in the effort. Whatever your dream is, whatever, like, whatever your dream is, whatever that you want to do, whatever you feel called to do by deity, or you just have it in your heart, you want to do this, go ahead and do it. Now, you going to make money with it right away or be successful? No, probably not. You got to work to get to that level of success. But there's nothing wrong with that, though. There's nothing wrong with that because then when you are successful, trust me, you feel good because you work to do it. You did the work. It's nothing. It feels so good when you had a dream of something and then you see the uh, fruits of it. You know, you are a writer. You wrote that novel. It might have took you years to write it. You know, rewrite it, and any writer knows, you know, you start with the first draft and then you gotta do so many other things. But then that final draft, shoot, making you a millionaire, bringing you fame and everything, you know? And you can go so far with it. Because once you open the door to success, or once you're successful in one area, it can lead you to so many other things. And this is very important, but it takes effort. You gotta do the work. You got to do the work. I don't care what it is. I don't care what you want to do. You have to do the work. You got to make the effort. Because if you don't want to make the effort, okay, well, you can keep dreaming about it, but you don't want to be on your deathbed thinking, I should have did this, I should have did that. When you're on your deathbed, you're going to be like, yeah, I came, I wanted to do this, this, and this, boom. And I'm going to speak for myself for a second here. Because people often talk about bucket lists. I actually don't have a bucket list. I've done everything I've wanted to do. I got to make up new stuff. And for everything I wanted to do, it took effort. It took effort. But I feel good because the effort paid off. The feeling you get when your effort has paid off is monumental. But you still got to put in the effort. So whatever it is, and every single one of y'all who's watching this, Every single one of you, you got something in you. I want to see y'all bring it out, okay? I want to see y'all keep going, okay? I want y'all to put in the effort, all right? So that's all I have for today. Think about what I'm saying and get to work. Put in that effort. I'll talk to y'all. Peace and blessings.